Hey guys, we're Dragon here, and we're back with more, you know, just more episodes of Minecraft Story Mode. Well, last episode, we built our big uh, place, so we're after Ruben now. He's our pig. He escaped. You know, look at our inventory. We have, like, flint steel, like, that, uh, wood sword that we automatically got. Let's take a look at this tree. Go. There's fire over there, but there's hoof prints. I think I trust mm, the hoof prints. Pig tracks. Ruben, I don't want to be out here in the dark. These definitely belong to a pig. Hmm, there's no way Reuben made these on his own. So well over here. Reuben? How dumb is Jesse like? Bro, I'm gonna pick up this carrot I just saw here. Hey Reuben, I got a carrot for you. Where are you, buddy? Reuben? Ruben, come here, boy! I hear some pigs. Maybe there's multiple pigs. Ruben, are you in there? Well, there's several friends around for these pigs, but there must Stupid be more... pigs. Like, leading farther? I don't know. Ruben! No, not you guys. Pigs! Hey, all pigs but Ruben, shut up! Where could he be? Yeah! For a chicken, like... <laughs> Like such a surprise. We can see a pig come out of here. Reuben, where are you, buddy? Yeah. No, I feel like we're running Reuben, some it's getting now. scary out here. Of course we are. It's like this default setting is up. Like, why would it be night if there's a no? Like, oh, there's it says it's motoring costume, so. This is the cost. Ruben. Ruben. Oh no, you in there, buddy? Oh jeez, please don't be toasted, Ruben. Yeah, he's fine. Whew. You know what it hurts to see a poor chop. Hey, buddy, you want a carrot? Oh, I'm so happy to see you. Coming out from the cave. Ruben, run! Whew. 
I think, I think we're good. I think we made it. Not. Time to fight. Here's our fight. Let's back up a little bit and let's swing and stab. Ah! Oh. Hey. Back! Get back! Stay behind me. I got you. Go back to the tree, don't. Out of the open. Oh, I want to show you something. Not that this isn't a really cool, dimly lit tunnel, but how far away is this thing you want to show me? Careful, Jesse. You don't want to get a reputation as a wimp. Y y this isn't my first time in a cave, Petra. Yeah, yeah when I went earlier. Have you ever seen a wither skull? Whoa! Fresh from the nether. You're the first person I've showed it to. You risked your life for that dusty old skull? Oh, I risk my life for the thing I'm gonna exchange for that dusty old skull. There's this guy I'm meeting up with at Endercon. He's gonna trade me a diamond for it. That's not worth it, man. It's more Being like a resident uh, go-getter pays off every once in a while. Just go keep is finding a, a skull cave. worth that much? <laughs> Are you kidding? For all the trouble I had to go to get it, I should be asking for much more. Mm -hmm, exactly. Wow. Wow. What? In a single day, you went to the Nether. You killed a Wither skeleton. I mean, I did build a super cool statue, but still, it's pretty sweet being you, huh? You know, you could come with me. Oh, that sounds great. I'll come with you. I mean, you. if you're too nervous, I totally get it. But I wouldn't mind a little backup. You want me to come with you? Consider it my charitable act for the day. I'll consider it whatever you want me to consider it, as long as I get to come. You just keep a crafting table down here? Comes in handy. Since that wooden sword of yours got busted... You're giving me a new one? Even better, you can make your own. One stick right, plus crafting. two stones equals one sword. Just grab what you need. Oh, okay, thanks. Hey, is all this stuff yours? 
No, we're just stealing from whoever was dumb enough to leave this here. Of course it's mine. Just making sure. Oh, here we go. Jackpot. It's craft, guys. Just place the pieces on the table. Come on, Jesse. We don't have all night. See? Isn't it better when you make it yourself? Now Ava saw it. Let's go. Check it out. Endercon's all lit up. I can't believe it. We won! I knew the zombie would put us over the top. Oh yeah, we won! Good for you, Jesse. It's about time we beat Lucas and his gang of jerks. What kind of stupid name is the Ocelots, anyway? Yeah. <laughs> you know, Lucas may be kind of arrogant, but he yeah, has no come for me in tricky situations. You might want to get to know him, just in case. He's good at building, that's for sure. It's always useful to have a guy like that around, no matter what you might think of him personally. Hey, I'll be a gracious winner, but that's it. He'll get one handshake and one good build, good build. Nothing more, nothing less. Just think about it, okay? Come on, let's hurry. Remember what Andercon was like before it was cool? Remember what we were like before we were cool? Some of us will never be cool. Ha ha. Ah, more mobs. Creepers! <sighs> Crap. This doesn't look good. Well, there's only one way off this bridge. And that's all. Whatever we do, we do it together. All right, let's jump. Woo! Woo! And of course, it's in slow motion. No, you dive into the water. You don't land on top of it. Yeah. Pull yourself together and follow me. Just let me know if you see Reuben anywhere. He's got to be here somewhere. I hope you're right. Yeah. Maybe so, maybe when right. we're making the deal, I need you to let me do the talking, okay? I just don't want anything to screw this up. Sure, I'll let you handle it. And if you want to be really useful, try to look intimidating. Like this? I'm less scared of you than scared for you. Oh, sorry, I unplugged my headphones. Jesse. And Petra? Hey, you all know Petra, my new super close friend. We're super close now. We ran into each other while I was looking for Reuben. Couldn't find him, huh? He'll turn up sooner or later. I just know it. I saw him, but before I knew what was happening, we were under attack by a zombie horde. I told him to run. It was for his own good. What were you doing in the woods, Petra? Okay. Nothing. Just drawn by the sound of Jesse's high-pitched screams. <laughs> I would have been spider bait if she hadn't found me. Sorry we didn't come with you, Jesse. But hey, we won. We won. 
Looks like abandoning friends and their time in need paid off yet again. You guys built one hell of a zombie. Yup. Oh, okay, look we? at this beautiful zombie. I still wish I'd gotten that part in the back to look better. Yeah. You deserve a now we get to meet party. Who's in? Okay. Now we get to meet Gabriel. Hey, I hope we have fun meeting him. I like all kinds of parties, but especially ones where I get to celebrate winning. About time I'll be the guest of honor at something. Hey, Jesse, it's time to go see about that thing. Oh, right, the thing. Subtle. Yeah? As a punch to the face. Axel and I were going to head into Endercon anyway. See you in there? I heard somebody saying there's free cake by the map booth. Hurry. We're supposed to meet in the alley over there. Of course it's dark. 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 Very dark in here. That's weird. He said the dark, creepy alley close to the gates, but he's not here. Maybe he's late. Are you sure this is the dark, creepy alley he meant? Hmm. I was. Okay, new plan. You stay here, just in case this is the spot he meant, and I'll look around. I guess I could have heard him wrong. Then again, I've never gotten a meetup spot wrong before. Something about this feels off to me. All of my secret deals feel off. That's why I usually keep them a secret. I'll be back before you know it. If he shows up while I'm gone, just stall for me. Just who are you? I'm waiting. The name's Jesse. What's it to you? I'm supposed to meet with Petra, not whatever you're supposed to be. Give me one good reason why I shouldn't walk out of here right now. Well? I'm ready to do this deal if you are. My deal is with Petra. She'll be here, but we can get started without her. Do you have the skull? Uh, well... You do or you don't. Petra has it. She'll be back any minute now. Well, as long as she's bringing it. I suppose it wouldn't kill me to wait a minute longer. Let's get to waiting. Uh, well... Ivor! Ah, here she is. Sorry I'm late, but good things are worth waiting for. I've got what you asked for. If you have what you promised us... You didn't say anything about an us when we first met? And I don't like surprises. If these are the sorts of people you associate with, perhaps we should call the whole thing off. My friend is fine, right, Jesse? There's no problem here. Let's not be too hasty, okay? Let's just do this thing. That's what I thought. Proceed, then. I'll take that diamond now. Take it. You've earned it. Well, the chest. We watch this snap and we're gonna get ripped uh, off. This isn't a diamond. No, yep, we just it's got ripped lapis. off. Turn back, he's not gonna be there. Of all the dirty, underhanded tricks to pull. I knew we couldn't trust that guy. Screw this. We're going after him. I'm either getting that diamond, or I'm getting my skull back. Yeah, or you'll make him pay, right? Right? Come on. Do you see him anywhere? He let me lost him. Then we'll just have to find him again. Go. Step aside, please. I have just one question. Hold all your questions until after the keynote. But the keynote sold out. Hold all your questions anyway. You guys big Gabriel fans or something? Too bad it's sold out.
Sup? Sup? Nothing? Sup with you? Nothing. Sup with you? I, I just said nothing. Hey, uh, congrats on the win. I mean, I still think our beacon was amazing, but you guys did a pretty good job, too. I mean, I thought the whole monster theme was plenty cool, but fireworks, too? You know, that stunt your friend pulled really hurt my pig. Okay, maybe, but I had nothing to do with that. He's still missing, you know. Sorry. I hope you find him soon. Hey, you didn't happen to see a creepy guy with long hair and a beard roaming around, did you? I don't think so. Why? He kind of scammed Petra out of a diamond earlier. Oh, everyone knows you don't mess with Petra. Not if you know what's good for you. I'll keep an eye out, okay? Thanks, I appreciate it. Petra's the bee's ass, watch. So, uh, we're cool? Yeah, we're cool. Cool, cool. Coolio. Coolness. Ha! See you later, Lucas. Yeah, see ya. <laughs> Thought you could just wiggle right out of that trap, didn't you? Well, wiggle as much as you want. You're not going anywhere. Axel, listen up. Any chance you've seen a creepy-looking, beardy guy anywhere? No. Petra told me what happened. I'm keeping an eye out for him. Okay, so I got a little distracted. It's just this machine presses all my buttons. Unnecessarily complicated and mean to birds for no reason. It's just, when something like this calls, you gotta answer. Well, if you're just gonna mess around, don't bother. Come on, let me help. I just got distracted for a second. Nope, find him without you. Have you seen Ruben? I was hoping he might have made it to town while I was distracted. I haven't seen hide nor hair. But I'm sure he's fine. He's a tough little ham. Axel? All right, all right, I'll look. After I watch one more chicken get home. I see you now, weirdo. Alright, so we end this episode here. See you later. Bye.